I stayed there just collecting all my pinned up hair. <laughs> I'm sure that she got a wife. Hey guys, it's Alexa. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, what's up? If you're not new here, thank you for the support and love. Love you guys. All right. So today I'm super excited. I figure why not stick on the bathing suit, swimsuit, whatever you want to call it, grind or path. Review some of my favorite bathing brands, rate them, which one's my favorite, which ones would I buy again, yada yada yada. Just gonna get into all of the juicy deets. <laughs> I feel like since it's summer, I'm pretty much living in bathing suits. If you're not yet subscribed, you should totally check me out or check out my other social medias and your sweet comments. Don't think that I don't see them. I read like pretty much 90% of my comment section. After a while, the mean comments come in and then I'm like... <laughs> but the sweet comments, I see you. I'm lurking and I'm stalking when you least expect it, so... <laughs> Let's just jump right into it. I'm not gonna go in any specific order. I'll start off with this bathing suit from H&M, because I feel like that's a good place to start. It's pretty easy to get your hands on any H&M bathing suits. This one my boyfriend got for me, shout out to him. I liked that you could buy the top and bottom separately, that's like a big thing for me because I'm bigger on the top than on the bottom. I usually wear small bottoms and large or like medium top for my bubs, so there's that. This I would give like a solid okay bathing suit. Nothing sticks out to me about it, it, d it does the job, gets the job done. I think it was a pretty good price, they had a sale, so I want to say that I got this probably like top and bottom separately were like $15, so all together maybe $30, I want to say, maybe even cheaper. But I know bathing suit prices are, I feel like are increasing <laughs> like every year. So, and it all depends on like what style you pick, obviously. Next we got White Fox Booty. I know you guys are waiting for like Shein and all that. We'll get there. We'll get there. Sit down, little baby boos. White Fox is a super cute clothing brand. I don't know if they're like specialized in bathing suits, but I've gotten some of the bathing suits from them before. So I figured might as well review them. I only, I think I only have the triangle style ones from them. They are definitely cheeker though. So if that's what you like, I would say White Fox is a good option. They're very cheeky. Perfect for like tanning, but I don't like showing too, too much cheek quality of it is good in my starbucks it's like really melting i get iced matcha latte with six pumps of brown sugar syrup and vanilla sweet cream cold foam and the closest way i could describe this is probably just it kind of tastes like boba milk tea a little bit to me i don't know but it's sweet and it's good these prices are definitely a little bit more expensive than h&m but the quality is better so Mm, I'm gonna give this a tie with H&M, um, but not bad. I probably would buy it again, but I don't think it's a bathing suit like must. You could probably just get one from H&M or Target. It would be like fun. Cupshe, I just worked with them for my last video. They're a very sweet brand and very affordable. Not all of the pieces though on Cupshe are like you could do different top and bottom, which that's very important to me, being able to do top and bottom, but you can do buy some top and bottoms differently. This is one of these sports tops. I do think I like Cup Cheese bathing suits more than Shein. I think the quality is a little bit better. The price might be a little bit more. I'm not too sure, but it's still like super affordable. Probably around the same same price as H&M and they have a really big variety of style. I just wanted to make a note that the Cup She one piece bathing suit is probably my favorite one piece bathing suit I've ever gotten. I'm only getting into one piece bathing suits now. But this is a size small, it fits, it works, and I think it's super flattering. So if you, if I wanted to recommend one place, I just think places like, um, that are specifically bathing suit brands that are more affordable, it just takes a little bit longer to try and find a bathing suit that works for you, if that makes sense. Like, you really have to search for the perfect style and, like, read reviews and all this and that. Which, of course, takes up some time, good price, affordability, and cute bathing suits. So I'm gonna do black bow swim now. I have two bathing suits from black bow. I haven't ordered any other ones and I'll get into that in a minute. I do really like the quality of black bow. You could tell. I mean these bathing suits are I want to say like a hundred dollars. Like 50 for the top, 50 for the bottom. You can tell a, a difference in the quality of the bathing suit. I don't know how to describe it. It does feel like it's worth more the bathing suit quality. I like how again you could pick out the different 
sides and bottoms. You could ever complain. It has a little black bow logo right there on this green one. Um, I feel like this blue one is better quality than the green one. I don't know. That's but I only got these in the triangle tops. Both tops and I think a large. And the only thing is this like triangle top is a little tiny. That's the one thing that's always like freaks me out is because if you get it from this like place and it's so expensive and it doesn't fit you're like shoot now i have to pay to ship it back get a new size these ones you really have to make sure you get the right size like see this is the large and this cup is way bigger so i like how they have different style bottoms though again it does feel like since you are paying more for the price you get more options and more i've had these for a year the quality is still there they're not showing any signs of wear and tear it's just the price that really gets me. Some Shein ones right here. Well, I only have this one triangle Shein one. But everyone knows Shein. They get the job done if you're not going to wear your, the heck out of your bathing suits. And now Shein's starting to get better. I like you could do separate to tops and bottoms. But for the most part, they only do the one size, which is kind of annoying. But they are affordable. That's like the one thing. Bathing suits are really expensive nowadays. But with Shein, again, you just have to read reviews in order to see what's gonna work out good. Cause sometimes you could, this is a large top and sometimes you could get it and it'll be like this big as a large top and you're like, and sometimes you could get them and they're very cheeky and sometimes they're more coverage. Like I still wear sheen bathing suits and I, my sister still wears them and they, it gets the job done. But it's definitely not my favorite brand. Do you think that you could invest in other bathing suit? Not bad, good price, but it's not like anything like, whoa, like turning my head at. Next, we're gonna do Grey Bandit, which is a new brand that I got into. I'll be honest, the only reason I got this is because of Anna Stow Stowell. I think I'm saying her name right, Anna Stowell. She's a TikToker. She came out with this Grey Bandit X Anna collab. And so I got this for myself and the matching, um, bottoms for my boyfriend and he's been wearing those bottoms all the time he loves them it's and they're like good quality i was pleasantly surprised i think that the tops and bottom it was like 60 dollars together triangle and black bone them are like 100 plus and then like h&m and sheen and them are probably like 40 dollars and under so this is like a middle man and the quality is good like i think that you could wear this and it feels nice i obviously haven't been wearing it a lot so i can't say how long the longevity would last but i do like bathing super brands that could do both that could do good quality and give it to you at like good price so that's why i think Grey bandit is probably going to become one of my new favorite brands i think Grey bandit and anna did a great job with this collection i like it and i want to try out more gray banded bathing suits before I say it's like my favorite brand, you know? All right, and last but not least, we're going into Triangle now. Triangle is probably one of those high-end brands that I will, I wanna say continue to buy because they have the cutest patterns and good quality in this and that. However, recently, if you don't know, they come in these good bags. This bathing suit was the first Triangle bathing suit I got. I only got it last year. And I probably wore this bathing suit the most. I get the top in a large and the bottom in a small. But it like faded. If you could see, this is how it was when I first got it. This like, right? And this is how it is now. It's kind of hard to tell on camera, but it's very faded, not as bright. And it is kind of upsetting because you spend a lot of money on it. And then you're like, what the heck? So I am going to reach out to Triangle. They have a really sweet customer service team. Uh, I'm pretty sure they'll help me out with this problem. But I am a little bit disappointed in that that was just the regular pattern though i have it in the sparkly pattern as well i know other brands will try and do sparkly ones and they itch me really bad <laughs> and i have very sensitive skin but triangles one doesn't itch me unless i have a sunburn i like how triangle though has a really supportive top and bottoms like they don't move when you put them on because they have this elastic grip on the inside so you could tell they really put the time and effort into making these, but I just have to give an honorable mention. My favorite triangle thing is the velvet ones. I don't know if you have like a texture thing or what, but these look so good on. I love how they feel, look so nice. And again, it has like the elastic on the inside so it doesn't move around. You could go in the ocean with these. The velvet ones are probably my favorite from triangle, I would say. The velvet one also came with this bag, which is super cute. The bag alone, I use a lot, so I feel like I get my money's worth out of it. And also, another thing about Triangle, 
is you could get different top and bottom of course and get cheeky or more full coverage bottoms but the triangle tops that triangle has get it triangle triangle they don't work for me i tried like the large maybe i need to try extra large because the cups are like too small and they don't feel as supportive as the other triangle bathing suits so just wanted to throw that out there comment down below any other bathing suit brands you think i should try i have any clothing brands what you guys want to see and don't forget to like comment and subscribe i hope you guys all have an amazing day i love you all so much and as always peace love and blessings bye my loves